Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and welcome any new viewers who just happened upon this video. Hope you like it, and I hope you uh, stick around to uh, see what's going on. Because frankly, I had no idea what's going on. But welcome back, you guys, to Solaris Console Edition Season 2 as the Aldari Confederacy. <clears throat> so, last time, <coughs> I apologize, still getting over this cough, but I'm coughing less than I was before. But um, basically, last time we had finally, and I mean finally, taken out the order. They now are a tributary state of the Confederacy. We are getting 25% of their empire wide resources. And look at this. This is crazy. <laughs> we do have a couple issues regarding. <coughs> <coughs> unrest on their former capital, because we did seize their capital. Or seize their capital, sorry. We're having a couple issues, because we did take their uh, former capital. A little bit of unrest and stability issues, we'll be trying to solve that later. Um, we also took this uh, system over here, which will, I think, also be causing some problems. Oh yeah, 100% <laughs> crime rate runs. 11% stability. Oh yeah, <coughs> we're gonna be having some some issues for a while. So I'm thinking the biggest thing we're gonna be doing is um, definitely going to be um, working on administrative administrative issues because uh, yeah, our empire sprawls a little um, over the top. So, yeah, <laughs> we're going to be trying to fix that. We're going to be trying to crack down on the crime that we have in our uh, territory, because we do have a insane amount of crime. And, uh, I don't know, just, uh, this is going to be just kind of a, my fucking controller, there we go. Just a chiller, um, empire management, um, episode. Because <coughs> we're in desperate need of it. I mean, that's that's undeniable. I kind of want to keep this fortress world here. This isn't going to stay a... Um, what's this? Overclocking. Our researchers have managed to isolate the cause behind the recent spikes in our supercomputer CPU clocking. Oh, perfect. Okay, so wait a minute. Two more times, this have expressed um, considerable excitement towards this unexpected improved uh, improvement in AI learning behavior. Hmm. Ah, you know, fuck it. Let's do it. And then we're going to do. Space black site because we need to get crime under control. <coughs> uh -huh, the autonomous alliance is trying to rebuild since they lost um, the administration. Okay, this one's not too bad. Crime's pretty low, but stability isn't the greatest. We can fix out of jobs, hopefully. Uh, first things first. Let's get. Um, let's get this. We'll get a precinct. Why slaves? We, we're not, we don't have slaves. Slave, slavery is literally banned. Great. I guess I better start, um, moving the, uh, <coughs> Confederate Armed Forces over here. Okay, so, they didn't care of that. Our armed forces are currently moving for our tributaries territory. Uh, what is this? The Massar. The Massar, if anybody remembers from the last episode, they are not a big fan of us right now. They actually consider us a threat, and they broke pretty much all of our packs of us. Woo, Jesus. Okay. <coughs> oh, wait. Are they actually in the negatives towards us now? Where are they?
Oh, yeah, they're actually in the negatives towards us. Oh, because they started putting a bunch of claims on us and everything. That's why their trust of us is 50, but they consider us a threat. And they don't like us, which is very <laughs> odd. Uh, it will cost us 20 missions. We will gain 69 credits, to, and they will gain 52. Come on, dude. Can we have the old partnership be what it used to be? Okay, let's wait and see what they... Oh, plus 5% research speed. Hell yeah. <coughs> nice, I like that. That's perfect. Okay, so... If I remember correctly, it said that tributaries can't be... Oh. Hey, perfect. And we're gonna gain so much freaking income from that. And they'll gain a bit as well. The Enterprise has declared the High Kingdom their rival. <coughs> this has been a very weird campaign. But um, if I remember correctly, it said that um, tributaries can't be integrated, if I remember correctly. Can we integrate them? Release subject. Integrate. Geometry subjects cannot be integrated. That sucks. Uh, why do you not want us as your subject? Oh, okay. You know, never mind. I can't do that. I can't do that. That's just pitiful. Improve relations with our tributary. <coughs> Can we? No, we can't do anything with them. Okay. <coughs> Alright, so now basically, let's just go ahead and try and crack down on the insane amount of freaking crime we have. Alright, so this one's fine. We're actually doing really well here in terms of keeping the crime under control, which is great. Um, Cirrus, you are fine as well, which is good. Uh, we'll go ahead and upgrade you. Radicalization. Ah, fuck. Okay, we're gonna have to, uh, split... <coughs> ...these forces. Go ahead and enter orbit. And maybe we should start deploying reserves. Yeah, let's we'll start head the reserves out, because I feel like we're going to need them. <sighs> one thing after another. Treadway, you're one of our original uh, <coughs> stations. Oh, boy. Okay. Um... It's gonna cost us some most we don't have, but Eesh. I'm not quite convinced that martial law is needed yet. Stability's still high, it's just high crime rate. It is appearance of this planet's uh, original population remains a mystery. Once the shield went up and they were isolated from the rest of their Aerosaur Empire, they were likely faced mass famine and civil unrest as they struggled to support their capital's massive population with what limited resources they had. Oh, wonderful. Uh, yet there are no signs that they uh, demolished parts of the city plan to cultivate the land. Eesh. Brutal. Okay. Yeah, I'm not convinced that we need to do martial law in Treadway. I think Treadway is pretty safe for now, so it's got a high crime rate. This one's a problem. We have a Hall of Judgment here. We have a lot of stuff here we need, but the squints are fucking running amok. And you know, there's really nothing I can do about it. How much gas do we have? Oh, we got plenty of gas. <coughs> Let's go ahead and upgrade this to an advanced research complex. Um. Hmm. 
Yeah, you know what, that's fine. Fincastle, how are you looking? Not terrible. You're doing okay for now. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade you as well. What are you supposed to be again? Oh yeah, this one's supposed to be just literally a farming world. I think, yeah, because this is where we put most of it, and this is like another industrial type world. Alright, cool. Because we're actually making them equal, we're not having any more slave issues. We distrust aliens, but we're not totally racist. Only mildly. So, yeah. I mean, we'll make some bureaucratic buildings wherever we can. Just not pick up the slack, because god, we are hurting. Okay, yeah, you're gonna go to, uh, martial law and anti-war, or not anti-war, freaking um, <coughs> anti, um, <coughs> crime campaigns, because that's an issue. <coughs> you know what, maybe we just redo this one, maybe we just make this one a, a penal colony. Actually, no, because we kind of need that. Maybe we should make a penal colony, start cracking down on some of this crime. I feel like that's a good idea, actually. So let's go ahead and do that. And you know what? Let's put it in... a system that is not strategically important, just in case we have a revolt. Put in the black hole. Nah, man, I can't put in the black hole. That sucks. Where can we put it? That's not strategically important. How cool have been, how cool would that have been though if we could have put it like over the black hole? Like that would have been cool if we could have done that honestly. But, you know, that's fine. Alright, well while well, this is going, I'm gonna cut back and I'll catch up with you guys in a few minutes once uh okay, wait, we're actually losing resources now. What the fuck just happened? <coughs> Okay, uh, once I figure out what happened, I'll come back to you guys. A question. Oh, shit. I just, kicked my, I just bumped my desk. <laughs> uh, overseers on uh, Mando supported disturbing development among our robotic workforce two weeks ago at roughly 0300 hours. Robotic worker A5091-B paused in the middle of its uh, designated task approached the night shift over um, foreman and uttered the following quietly. Wait, the robot said this? Is unit A5091-B in possession of a soul? The only form of the event is a software glitch and, reor <coughs> and reordered the robot to resume regular functions. However, upon boot up, the following work cycle uh, robotic worker, the same robotic worker once again repeated the soul searching qu uh, query. <coughs> and continued to pers to uh, just multiple debugging attempts. Mm. Can a machine have a soul? We refuse to dignify this malfunction with an answer. Yeah, no. We're not, uh, we're not humoring that. That's not a thing. Hmm. That's interesting. Interesting <coughs> and slightly concerning. But we're not going to worry about it too much. Oh, yeah, I did. Order restored. Yes. Perfect. Okay, am I doing this wrong or something? Mm. 
done. Oh, I'm fucking done. Yep, I'm dumb. I'm very dumb. Situation log updated. Go ahead and research that. I am so very stupid. I have not messed with robots before. <sighs> At least the ones in our mining world will get some upgrades. Now where are the fleets? We need to uh, get them taken care of. Reinforce the home guard. Get nope, they're good. Um, do we need to add any more ships to the fleets? Probably. Oh, we do. Okay. <clears throat> what do they have? Battleships, torpedo cruisers. Let's get a couple more battleships. And there we go. Um. And a couple more frigates. Oh, sweet. <coughs> Perfect. Get them. A couple more. Oh, no, wait. That's not our frigates. Never mind. Oh, we have a war breaking out. Who's that war of who? Central Array Power Surge. Ooh. The Makaro Company and the Commonwealth for that war. Interesting. I wonder if that's gonna work. Now, one thing we do need to do eventually is take out these freaking holy crap! Um, you know what? Never mind. Never, uh, never mind. We don't need to do anything to them. <laughs> We do have a need to upgrade the uh, Odari fleet, because I just realized they're still pretty outdated. But, um, uh, holy tits. Are you kidding me? A smuggler's post? Come on, give me a break. Don't need more of your shit. Okay, so... Right now, the situation is relatively the same. We're getting back up on consumer goods, which is great. Uh, more and more packs are being broken, which is kind of good for us. Uh, and I also started work on the fourth fleet that I talked about potentially doing last episode. Or, yeah, was it last episode? Pretty sure it was last episode. <coughs> so, that's going. I'm not totally sure what this fleet is going to be for yet. Wait. I think there's a reinforcement for one of our fleets. As why else would there be a bunch of... Okay, that was weird. Don't know why that happened. Here's the start of our next fleet. Right now, it's just, gonna, it's just made of mostly Corvettes, because that's what the... <coughs> the, um... They decided to prioritize. A lot of Corvettes. Why? I have no freaking clue. But, you know what? I'm not going to question it. Because right now, we need the fleet power. Oh, damn, look at that. Our bureaucratic shit is no longer a problem. We just gotta sort out our food again. We haven't had any food issues in a while, but we have plenty stocked up now. So I'm not too worried about making that right away. Okay. That's 1.6, which is 12 Corvettes. That's hilarious. Okay. 
Okay, let's take a look at crime real quick and figure out if this has been a long enough episode. So Aldari's still fine, Cirrus is fine. <coughs> this one's only 22%, which isn't horrible. And we still have plenty of jobs being taken care of. Okay. We were doing mercantile last time, apparently. Plus one clerk jobs. We never always fill those, so we're not going to do that yet. Uh, unlocks consumer benefits and marketplace of ideas trade policies, which allows us to convert a portion of our trade value into consumer goods. Hells yeah. <coughs> I'm all for that one. Consumer benefits, here we go. Uh, earns us 0.5 credits and 0.5 consumer goods. I'm for it. Oh wow, our mining just went down big time. But that's fine, because we are starting to get, um, like I said, more jobs filled. Ow! Jesus, what the fuck? I hope that gets fixed shortly. Because it's... Oh, wait a minute. I love what we got some trade. I might need to change that back. Because we're officially losing a lot of money. Okay. Archaeologists working on... Uh, random V have reached a... Highly unstable section of the ruin. I'm gonna regret that. Alright, cool. Alright, so our fleet currently sits... Oh my god, okay. <coughs> fleet limit... Um, entertainment complex... That's interesting. Land limit plus one. Hmm. Interesting. Look at fleet limit. <laughs> Considering we officially need it. Let's put an energy grid on this planet and to see if we can do anything to like mitigate this. You are a new colony that was being developed. This one is going to be an energy world. Because we officially... No, 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 no. There we go. We officially need it. And so uh, we can figure out what the fuck just happened. Turns trade value into credits. So why it... Okay, wait a minute. Let me take a look at this again. Each trade value... Vi each collected trade value earns us 0 0.5... Oh, Tears of an AI. There has been an incident at one of our facilities on Treadway. A lab AI involved in uh, societal research has suffered terminal hardware damage, resulting in the loss of core software and memory systems. As a result, there will be a projected decrease to research output at the lab. Until the AI installations algorithms have been uh, sufficiently uh, seeded. Circumstances behind this terminal failure are unknown. Damn it. Let's figure out what happened. So that's the problem. <sighs> we don't have enough trade value to support what I just did. Evacuation. Today is the day. Report to your nearest relocation center as soon as possible to begin your new life. Okay. Ah, alright, okay. Alright. This is, uh, this is fine. Ah, okay. <coughs> Our inquest into the loss of an AI in Treadway has returned something baffling. Has returned some baffling results. 
Prior to his terminal failure, the AI had made <coughs> repeated attempts at purging its own records and memory banks. Okay. When lab staff disabled the AI's access to deletion function, the AI appeared to have faced a, a termination of its core operating by manipulating... So... Basically, it committed suicide? Okay, let's figure out what the fuck just happened there, because it sounds like that robot just committed suicide. That is literally what that sounds like to me. Oh boy. This is getting weird. Okay, so we need to work on stabilizing the economy more. But it's the thing is, we have control of so much trade value. I don't know what to do with that. <coughs> well, I think for now, this is probably going to be where we end today's episode. Oh, wait. Actually, wait. Not yet. Hold on. Ah! Okay, Jesus. We have concluded our inquiry into the strange matter of AI self-termination on Treadway. Evidently, following months of evolutionary er, computation, the AI proceeded... Oh no, sorry. Reduced several alarm alarming results with regard to uh, country projections in the case of all out war between the Eldorian Confederacy and our rivals. Despite repeated re-examination of all available data, <coughs> resources, <coughs> agencies, the AI projections remained. Uh, huh. At this point, the AI began purging its own memory banks and recalling. Okay. That is very concerning. Now, I just remembered. I want to check real quick on our station that's being built. Okay, it's not even halfway yet. Oh, no, it's about halfway. Over halfway. Okay. <coughs> well, that can go ahead and build. We're going to go ahead and end the episode here for today. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. It really means a lot. And if you haven't already, consider subscribing. It really means a lot. And help the channel grow. And help me reach my goal of 100, 100 subscribers this year. With that said, I'll see you all next.